Hiya, fellas! This is November the 1st, and as always, it is time for our top videos of the couple months, like we do every couple months. This time and from now on, things will be a little different. But first, some things haven't changed. As always, the videos will be in chronological order, and as always, you will have a playlist linked at the end of the video. So if you don't want to hear me talk for 10 minutes, just jump to the end of the video, click on the playlist and enjoy yourself. You got a lot of videos this time, about 80 of them. And this brings me to what has changed. Now I won't be talking about all the videos in this video, just about half of them. So you will have a lot of surprises and also this will allow me to add videos at the last minute or even after I've made this video digest. In the past, I have been frustrated a lot because I forgot to add videos and I noticed it too late. Now, flexibility, and because of that flexibility, this will allow me to make one of these videos every month like I did in the beginning, instead of every couple months like I've been doing lately. So, I think I've said everything. Let's just jump into it. Oh, by the way, I, uh noticed that last time I stopped uh, at August the 30th and uh, omitted videos from August the 31st. So uh, it doesn't start at September the 1st, it started August 31. And uh, the first video in the playlist is The Rise and Fall of the Japanese Zero by Real Engineering. It's about a, a Japanese plane during World War II that was at the top of the line and then suddenly wasn't. A brand new type of brand cell just been discovered. This is awesome news. History's Worst Non-Water Floods by Samola Academy. The Road and Tear List Fit Real Life Floor by Tear Zoo. These videos, pretty much everything is in the title. Uh, Why else? The Curious Case of Ronald Opus. For people who are interested in law, this is a, a very interesting story about law and, and justice. Music from an alternate reality from 10 Second Songs. This is a great video. I don't know if you're familiar with the concept of covering a song in the style of a different band, and this takes the, the, the concept up to 11, and, and it's, uh, it's funny and it's really well made. There's a cover of Katy Perry's Firework by Chase Holfelder. Uh, would John Tron approve? Asks Chase. I think he would. Uh, what else? Six of the planet's best hunters by SciShow. When you think about the best hunting machines in the animal kingdom, you think maybe about the lion or the bear or the wolf, but there are much more efficient killers amongst the predators, and you will probably be surprised by some of them. I'm clickbaiting right now, this is awful. Uh, what else? Blueberry Cheesecake Homemade Yogurt by John's Kitchen, a totally over-the-top recipe of homemade yogurt. 30 Strange Gaming Controllers You Probably Don't Remember, a great video by GameRanks. How to Make 12 Types of Sushi with 11 Different Fish by Bon Appetit, a uh, really beautiful video. Well, the Mystery of the Biggest Genomes by SciShow. We discovered some animals and plants with a lot of DNA, like really a lot, and we're not sure why they have so much DNA. It's a pretty interesting video. Three video game themes you should never play in Red Time by Johnny May, great pianist, great musicians, <clears throat> great pianist, great musicianship, music, musicianship, musician, great pianist great musicianship and really funny. 1992 Smart Clapper vs. Philip Hugh by Linus Tech Tips. It goes as well as you would expect and more. What if humans were nerfed by Tutor Zoo? Very interesting. How to make a bulletproof iPhone case by How to Basic. Some people think that they've seen one video of How to Basic, so they've seen them all, and that he has a shtick and that he always does the same thing, but this video is kind of different. Uh, than what he usually does, so uh, if you've been bored with How To Basic lately, uh, this maybe will uh, reignite your enthusiasm in the character. What else? Mount St. Lens is about to blow up, another great song by Billwords. 
The Curse of Blood Poe Ashens by Norwich Gaming Festival. It's a video about uh, anti piracy and the measures that have been in place against uh, software uh, piracy. The, some of them are were silly, some of them were don't write crazy, and Ashens does a presentation, kind of like a TED talk about this, it's really funny. What else? Uh, why Amazon is worth one trillion by Polymatter. Uh, Andy makes shrimp and basil stir fry from the test kitchen by ABT. Uh, we are the last humans left by Exerbia, really interesting and also uh, thought inducing. The crazy plan to recreate the Russian Empire in Africa. That, that's funny and also informative. I love it. Uh, what else? The scientific benefits of boredom by Veritasium. I love this video. Boredom is really underappreciated. And I think that's the last video of September. Lindsay Lohan attempts a kidnapping by Critical. And it's, it's exactly what's in the title. It's really funny. I probably heard about it already, but this, uh, there's a live stream and a commentary that, that's uh, really entertaining. Uh, what's next? Uh, we're in October now. Uh, F It Up by Louis Cole, a great live sesh. Great musician, great song, pretty amazing. Jonas has a cold. It's dinner, it's level 30. So if you're familiar with Tetris, uh, you know what this means. You probably already know Jonas. Boom! The twist for Jonas! If you saw the 2016 uh, World Ch Tetris Championship, he was the, the winner, the world champion, uh, and he's a pretty amazing guy, and his reaction when he hits level 30, uh, that, uh, that, that really famed prize level 30 in Tetris. It's, it's, I love this video. Um, Next, why China embed its one-child policy? A great video about demographics. King Crimson, indiscipline, live in Mexico City. Okay, so Adrian Bilu isn't there, and his replacement is not, is not exactly as good as he is. I mean, he's, he's good, but he's not as exceptional as Adrian. But everyone else is there. There's Pat Mastelotto that I love. There's, of course, Robert Fripp, who looks and plays exactly like in the 70s, and the great Tony Levin. Uh, it's an amazing live. A video about the jambon beurre, my favorite sandwich in the world, by Brothers Green Eats. I catfished my kid on TLC by H3H Reproductions, the best H3H video of the year, in my opinion. It's a classic H3H, like in the good old days, you know? You know, like uh, the old Ethan, straight from Israel Ethan, you know? Uh, Great Your Grammar Sucks by Jax Films. Uh, what else? Why scooter startups are worth billions by Polly Matter. You've probably seen these scooters everywhere if you live in a big city, and there's an explanation of why they're there and why they're probably here to stay. Items are boring, a great reflections about items in video games by Rasmussen. I made a camera lens with an iceberg by my neighbor Matthew Stern. This guy went to Iceland to find 10,000 year old ice to make a camera lens out of. And the next video is Why Beautiful Things Make Us Happy by Kurt Gesagt. It's, uh, it's pretty informative. And uh, I remixed an abandoned military aircraft hangar by Andrew Wong. Great musical experiment. Uh, what else? X by Poppy. Poppy's on fire lately. Uh, you probably remember Poppy, that was a phenomenon at the start, and then her shtick became really mainstream and we started seeing her everywhere, so she became kind of boring in the eyes of the majority, but she still makes great stuff, her and her producer, uh, Titanic Sinclair, and this is a, a song called X that is really quaint, I think. It's a mix of uh, like the Beatles and uh, new metal of the late 90s, kind of like Limp Bizkit or some Slipknot songs. You know what it really uh, reminds me of? Orgy. Remember Orgy? Now that was a fun band. Uh, what else? Bohemian Rhapsody performed in 42 styles by 10 second songs, exactly what it says in the title. and. Pretty amazing. Kanye and the End of Reality by Wisecrack, 
a video about kayfabe and politics. A really great angry video game nerd episode, a Resident Evil Survivor, one of the best AVGN episodes of the year in my opinion, and a, a new video by Slipknot, the first new music released by Slipknot in four years. This is not an amazing song, it sounds like maybe a filler song from one of their precedent albums or a b-side maybe, but hey, it's still pretty good and it's still a nice surprise, so uh, I hesitated and then I decided to include it. Thanks for watching! Don't forget to subscribe and if you really like what I do and want to help me continue in the best conditions, please consider a subscription to my Patreon or a donation on Ko-fi. Links are in the video description. The playlist will appear around here in a few seconds. And yeah, thanks for watching. See ya really soon. Peace!